I guess what we'll do is just keep pushing down here and see if we can go take that out. And do our best, I suppose. Uh, the galaxy, generally speaking, I, I there isn't really much I can do. I actually, you know what? You know what? Let's head up here. Let's clear this out because I'm a bit sick of this. I kind of I kind of want that system to be honest. I kind of want to get rid of all the enemies in there because I'm not entirely happy with that. So if we can go and clear that out, I also want to try and clear out that system and set up some defenses. I also want to sit back a little bit. I want to be able to sit back and I want to start building my fleet. I want to focus on that. I want to focus on fleet strength and fleet size. And I want to start focusing on building the, the Federation as well. I might, well, I say that. I'm either going to build the Federation or... I'm going to build my empire, and I'm going to leave the Federation, and I'm going to forcefully take over everyone else. One of those things is going to happen. I don't know which. Most likely the first one, because forcefully taking over other empires is probably not going to go well, because I'll have to deal with all the factions and all that stuff. So, yeah, we'll not, we'll not worry too much about that right now. But I want to clear this space out, because I'm a bit sick of it, being as it is. Uh, that's fine. So that's been cleared. Science ship, come down here and survey this system. First and second fleet. I'm going to grab you guys. And do I need to survey that system? No, I don't. Okay. Uh, I want to go to that system as well. So let's head over there and see if we can uh, clear it out. Because I think there might be enemies in here. I'm not certain, but I want to make... Yeah, there are. All right. Who are you? Uh, support your independence. Of who? Who, do you, who are you trying to be independent from? Uh, you are a vassal under those guys. Okay, can I write? Okay, where the hell did the... Okay, they've gone. Apparently... Oh, they got blown up. That's fair. That's 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 probably fair. Uh, before that goes ahead, let me just merge you guys like so. There we go. So first and second fleet, move in there and start blowing those guys up. And once that's done, I want to grab my construction ship, which isn't actually doing anything right now. Um... Actually, you know, my construction ship can go up there. Uh, and I want them to build a construction ship. I want you to go there. Build me a military station. Build me the Takeshi class thing just there. So if you can get that done, we can defend that system pretty well. Which will be excellent news. What is this? Yeah, that's fine. So construction ship, go up there and build me a station. Which means nothing can come in from those two uh, planets there. Which is what we want. Uh, first fleet, you guys are still fighting. That's fine. Hopefully by the time you're done, the uh, construction ship will be ready to build me something down here. Because I want to get a Takeshi class platform there. And one there as well. So that'll be good. We'll get all these things in here. And we can, uh, we can properly defend our sector. Alright. So, uh, second fleet also needs that. Second fleet's gonna be super bloody strong at some point. Uh, right, so that's all going on. That's fine. We have actually pushed the Scourge back a little bit. I mean, these guys have some of their territory back. Uh, this area has been freed up a little bit. I think, generally speaking, we are doing okay. We could be doing better in terms of influence. It is definitely, uh, lacking a little bit. But I think we're doing just about okay. We do have some issues in that factions are doing their thing and sort of standing up and going, Hey, uh, the, the, the core sector, for example, wants independence. Uh, that's not going to be happening. The You have a decent bit of attraction there, actually. The independent Galsaposk... Okay, so yeah, the, the first army of Galsaposk is not getting independence. That's not happening, funnily enough. Uh, so you guys are... Doing your thing. The construction ship, I think, might be done. Is it? Yes, it is. Good. So, construction ship, I want you to go down there. I want you to build me a military station. Uh, we'll go with the Takeshi class one again. We'll just chuck it there. Then when you're done with that, uh, I want you to build me another one. Another Takeshi class one, just there. There you go. So, those are going to be excellent. Those will nicely defend those areas. Uh, so, that will be good. Right. So, while that's going on... Let me go ahead and grab my two fleets, one of which is getting to be very, very strong, which I completely support. There we go. So 14.3k. I'll take it. 
uh, let's go ahead and I think to wrap things up with this session of Stellaris, I reckon I want to head down here a little bit and try and take that planet. Just try and take those systems. Because I'm a little bit sick of the Scourge. Just a little bit. And who are you? Um, yeah, you guys aren't interested in my Federation. Why? Jessel Knox United Systems will vote no. Again, why? That's, that's strange. Uh, I can invite those guys. I can't invite these guys. Really don't know why. What about this, the uh, Imperium here? Uh, invite the Federation. They must be at peace. Okay. They are at war with... Okay, so the Xeron method... What? So, who are... The Galactic... Oh, really? You are at war with the Xeron Imperium? Really? You guys are... Oh, it's those guys again. So those guys are at war again. That makes sense. Okay, you are the overlord of that directorate. Um. Okay. And you're a Yeah, fair, fair, fair. Uh, so you're also at war with those guys. I kind of want the Xeron Imperium. What about the... What about you guys? Um. Demand... Why, I can't... I cannot propose this because you declared them a rival. And, I mean, I can't really end that rivalry, can I? Well, they I can end mine. They probably won't end theirs. Then the June United States, we will have, generally speaking, yeah, the United States is going to vote no. I'm going to leave this federation. I don't think this federation is doing much for me. I reckon I, I reckon Lee, I mean, they have a lot more ships than I do. That's kind of scary. Uh... Yeah, they have many, 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 many more ships than I do. Maybe I don't want to leave. Maybe I want to stay. Because uh, they seem like a fair ally to have. But uh, generally, I don't think I'm going to be going to war anytime soon anyway. Oh, I don't know. I think I will stay in the Federation just for the time being. Because if I don't, then I really don't have those guys to back me up if I do fancy going to war. Which I think eventually I will to take these three systems here. So we'll see how that goes. Let's just uh, let's let's head down here and take out this, uh, these systems, and see if we can uh, just push the scourge back a little bit more. And then, like I said, we'll wrap things up and we can think about war at a later point because I don't know. I've been recording for like two hours and fifteen minutes at this point, so it's probably a good idea to you know. Take a little bit of a break, take a step back, review what I'm doing, and make sure I don't accidentally declare war on someone that doesn't really need uh, war. So let's head up here, take these guys out. We'll have to bombard these planets as well. We can do that. Let's tell them to, uh, if I tell them to bombard the planet, they'll actually destroy everything around it and then go straight to the planet, so that'd be good. Uh, let me see, the second fleet actually has a leader, doesn't it? No. The first fleet has a leader. So that's fine. Uh... What if I was to say, like, take the leader from there and apply it to the second fleet instead? I feel like that would be a better idea. I don't know. We'll, we'll see. Well, how's my research going? Pretty well, actually. Pretty well indeed. Uh, let me see. Let me go to my ship designer whilst they're doing their thing. Let me go to Battleship. Could I change the Vader at all? Is there anything I could do? Like, if I added nuclear missiles, yeah, they're not as strong. If I added rail guns, again, not really as strong. Those plasma guns really are the way to go. They really, really are. Um, what about a large plasma cannon? No, still, not, it's not as strong as the R committer. Which I suppose is fair enough. Uh, large nuclear missile, also not as strong. What about a large rail gun? Yeah, still not as strong, so let's... Let's just go with the Archimeter and uh, basic fighter wings, I guess. So they are, they'll do, and okay, what what are they, what are they best at? So they are 3 to 5 damage and 8 to 12. What are they good at then? So basic fighter wing, basic fighter wing is, okay, and the basic bomber wing, I don't, what's the bloody difference? Uh... Larger enemy... Okay, let's go with the bomber wing instead. 
Let's let's do the bomber wing and save. There we go. What is this? Who's dead? The governor's dead. All right. Governor of what? Heredia Prime's governor? Oh damn. Ah, uh, that's a problem. That is uh, that is certainly a problem because we can't hire one right now. We are gonna have to get some more influence at some point. We really, really are. Uh, so where's my first fleet? There they are. Go and blow up that planet too. Go and get that done. Because, I mean, once once this is done, I want to go and uh, I think I want to go and and look at maybe getting some influence. So it might be worth going on a little crusade against these guys, but we'll see. Again, I think I'll leave it for the next uh, next episode and next little recording batch. So let's blow up this planet, which is really going remarkably fast. That is ridiculous. That is that is scary. I have a scary fleet. So that's been dealt with. There we go. And now that system is free, right? I think these guys are going to take it, probably. I think the system's free, isn't it? It seems to be. Oh, is the game lagging? No, I just haven't selected anything. Okay, so if we go there, uh, that system, I think, might effectively be freed up then. Uh, yeah, because we can't actually go back there. They've closed their borders. So we need to go through the rest of this territory. That's excellent. Thanks for that, guys. Um, yeah, I really don't want to, uh, there are systems that are not connected. What? There are systems that are not connected to their sectors. A? Right click to disable. Where? What is not connected to their sector? What? What's up here? Hold on a minute. What is this? That was absolutely not theirs. What the hell just happened? I'm almost certain this was mine. What is on the... What is going on here? System's not connect... I could swear that was mine. I'm almost certain of it. Yeah. It was, because this system, I had the Herodian Outer Rim went a bit further than that. Am I just, oh, for God's sake, right, hold on a minute. Construction ship, we need a uh, frontier outpost here, an observation post, terraforming, no, 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 no. Um, how do I get it? What? <laughs> I'm so confused. Um, construction ship. Uh, oh, God. Can you build down there? Construction ship, there. Frontier outpost. Oh god, I need a lot of influence to do that. I need a lot of influence. Okay, we really need influence. Um. Oh god, we need to get my fleet back home as well. Let's send my fleet. They can't get to Jeff. What? There's no route for the selected fleet to reach my system, because they have to go through the blue system. Right, we are going to war. I am not being cut off from my system. I'm going to war. I want to humiliate you, and I want open borders. That's what I want. We're going to war. I am not being cut off from my systems for any reason. All right, we're going in here. We liberated your system, and now we're going to blow it up. That's what we're going to do. You try to cut me off, we'll see how that goes, mate. Let's see just exactly how that goes. Situation. You are gonna regret this. This might be a bit. This might be overkill. Uh, it's ever. It's it's possible. But engaged. yeah, they 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 should have thought about that at the time. How's their fleet gonna? What 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 exactly is their fleet gonna do here? Can we focus on their fleet, please? They have a couple of them actually. No, they don't. They have one. Which I think we are tearing through quite nicely. Uh. We certainly seem to be. Yeah. They're not having much luck there. They certainly have a weaker fleet than we do, anyway. So that's that dealt with. Let's take out the rest of their stuff. Uh, namely the planet. I want to I take the planet. Uh, let's look at negotiations. So if I say that and that, yeah, they're not going to accept, funnily enough. If 
Funny that. Let's let's get rid of that. That's a little mining station there. Then bombard the planet. Let's just completely and utterly destroy their planet. Um, yeah, funny. They're still not going to accept. Funny that one. Um, yeah, all right. That's fine. Let's just blow up the planet. See what happens. We'll kill their people and all that stuff. Um, not really interested in, in, uh, in invading. But certainly interested in just destroying. Or, you know, just getting home at this point. Uh, I don't think they're attacking me anywhere else. No, I think I'm good. Let's look at research and see what we got. Uh, bio lab, leader capacity, army damage goes up. That'd be nice. Let's go with that. Why not? I'm not necessarily going to be invading anytime soon, but, uh, I'll take it. All right. So that planet has been pretty much leveled, which is good. How are we doing? Can I, can I say humiliate? No, you're still not going to accept. That's unfortunate. They've closed their borders. Now they'll accept standard peace. That's not going to be happening. What if I completed? Oh, I have completed another one. Uh, energy storage capacity would be nice. I'll take that. All right. I'm still not happy. System not connected to sector. What system? Is it this? It must be this one. So. Is it, is it you? No, you're the, you're the capital of the sector. I'm really confused here. It's that one, isn't it? It's the singularity. So it's this system has been taken or something and been cut off from that sector. That's kind of really annoying. I'm going to have to deal with that at some point. Uh, so let's move down and kill that. We've already pretty much wrecked their planet. So let's just go down and kill this thing. And then, I mean, I could continue through and blow up much more of their stuff and weaken them for the Scourge to deal with, but, uh... That might be a bit much. That might, that might just be a bit harsh, you know? I'll tell you what I'm gonna do. Here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna send my fleet back to Jeff. Just like that. Alright, I'm gonna get my fleet out of there. And then I'm gonna go for White Peace. Or whatever the hell it's called. So there's my fleets leaving. I pause. I gotta negotiate. I gotta hear. They're not gonna accept that. They're also not gonna take white peace at this point. Which is annoying, because I was gonna give it to them. I was I was gonna give them straight up peace, but now apparently they don't want it. Um I guess we are gonna go into their territory. Uh we'll go we'll go to here. Let's 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 go to there. Let's go blow them up. They didn't want peace. Apparently. Hostile fleet engaged. Where? Where did we just engage a hostile fleet? Oh, it's the Scourge again. All right. Let's go in and take on the Scourge, I suppose. I mean, I wanted to go and destroy the uh, these guys, but apparently the Scourge is is back. Great. I just wanted to wrap things up here, but apparently I'm not going to do that. Hey, 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 what is this? Um, Did they not? No. Okay. You didn't want peace. I mean, I, I don't know why. You were going to take peace earlier when I was completely crushing you, but apparently not anymore. Uh, let's go to here. Let's go. Let's move my fleets in there and absolutely crush them. We are going through some scourge territory, but we should be fine. To be honest, I can't imagine we're going to have too much to worry about here. So let's just keep moving in. Let's see what's in this bit. I want to see what's in here. Hostile ah, quite a th quite a few things actually. I suppose that's to be expected. We are pretty deep in Scourge territory, so if we can just get all this blown up. I guess we're sort of doing the galaxy a favor, really. So that's uh, I mean that's that's gonna go any second. That's gonna go any second. There we go. So that's gone. Let's go blow up the planet because we might as well. Uh, there is another planet down there that I'll deal with in just a moment. This won't take very long, which is nice. I also have a lot of minerals, so what I'm going to do is go here, and I'm going to say build me a Vader-class battleship. I'm going to go here and say build me a Vader-class battleship, and here and say build me a Vader-class battleship. So three more of those will be nice. Uh, that planet has now been freed. We'll go do that. So get that blown up. And uh, then we can blow this up. 
And I don't know what I don't know who this is gonna be freed for. Uh, but it's gonna free it nonetheless. Are those transport ships? They are. They look like they're about to jump as well. Okay. We'll send those guys down to blow them up before they jump. No, no, they're not jumping. They're actually turning to engage me. Which seems silly, if you think about it. They're they're transport ships, and now they're dead. Okay. I'll take it. I'll take it. That was that was easy. That was an easy victory over those guys. Uh, let's just get this blown up. And then we're good. Incoming transmission. What do you want? Um, sure. You can have my star charts. Why not? It'll be nice to see what's going on in other parts of the, uh, the galaxy. So let's see. What is this? Yeah, you've got a disconnected system. That's a shame. That is, uh, that is definitely a shame. But at least we're freeing up parts of the galaxy from the Scourge. I think the Scourge might have spread itself a bit too thin. It certainly seems like it. Now, that planet's been liberated, which is good. That's going to retract their borders even further. Uh, if I liberate this one, these guys get a foothold, I think. So I'm going to head straight to their system and actually blow them up. Uh, because they are... They are actually interested in white peace at this point. Which is nice. That's a nice change. Uh, so if I... No, I'm going to keep pushing. I'm going to keep pushing. Because I'm actually not happy that they closed their borders at all. Un Hold on a minute. Do I have to go? No, I can go through their system, so that's fine. Who's attacking me here? Is that more Scourge? Yes, it is. Right, well, go deal with the Scourge. That's fine. I'm actually quite happy fighting them. Uh, I can't actually move to that system without killing the Scourge. That's annoying. I want to. I want to teach these guys a lesson. I really do. I just... I'm not able to. Oh, hello. What's going on here? Oh, that's not much, is it? Is that... That is Scourge in the system. Okay. Let's head to there. Then let's head to there. Let's just blitz everything in here. This should be fun. This should be very fun. Because I don't think they have anything that can stand in my way right now. What is that? Is that a fleet of transport ships? I don't know what that is. That's something. I just don't know what it is. Okay, so we're dealing with these two spaceports. Uh, we have three more battleships that are almost completed there. So that's nice. That's, uh, that is, that is definitely nice. So that's been dealt with. War has been declared. That's fine. I'm not too worried, really. Uh, that's gonna go any second as well. Oh my god. Just the sheer amount of damage we do is remarkable. Oh, they've made peace. Good. All right. So let's, uh, let's move in here. Construction complete. Good. Uh, that's very, very good. We've got all of our new ships done. Which is good. We can, uh, we can get those over to the second fleet, uh, in a little bit. Let's just keep pushing through here and uh, dealing with the enemy. Which really can't do anything against me at this point, can they? They they really can't. And I really enjoy that. I really do, because my... My God! They are getting destroyed. Okay, let's... Uh, the best possible outcome. I'll take it. Are your borders open to me now? What a surprise. What a surprise that you would, you would in fact keep your borders open to me. Okay, let's go first fleet, third, uh, not first, sorry, second fleet, third, fourth, and fifth, and then merge you guys together. So you guys are all going to, uh, come down and merge up with the second fleet, which is going to knock it up to like 17, about 18,000, uh, military power. I'll take it. I will absolutely take it. We also need to go to Herdia Prime. We need to get a governor for uh, for Herdia Prime. So let's see. Let's go to recruit. Uh, you or you. Uh, army build speakers up. No, I'm not interested. Um, we'll go with that. We'll recruit you. Then the second fleet needs an admiral. Uh, there are a few available, which is interesting. What do you got? Fire rate goes up. Hull regeneration goes up. Range goes up. Evasion goes up. Uh, ship upkeep goes down, and evasion goes up. I kind of want fire rate to go up. 
I think that could be good for the second fleet. So there we go. Uh, what else can we do then? I mean, I have managed to push the Scourge back a bit. And I think they're being dealt with pretty well. Uh, in terms of everything else, I mean, my construction ship, I mean, my science ships as well need to go and scout some systems. So go survey that system. Then go survey that system. Uh, then I guess just survey a few systems around here that we don't know. And we have open borders with these guys. It'd be nice to survey these systems considering I want them at some point. Uh, so go survey those, then go survey that one, then survey that one. I'm just going to keep my science ship busy, I guess. There's not much else it can do. Uh, so survey that system as well. I said survey that system as well. Or don't. Okay. What about that one? Um, no, I think he, that might be the maximum number of things the science ship can do right now. Uh, construction ship, on the other hand, it would be really nice to get a, like, a, a frontier outpost done here. I don't have the influence to do it, though, unfortunately. So that kind of sucks. Uh, but at least we have a bunch of, of ships. We have a pretty powerful... Uh, fleet right there. I think what I'm going to do is... Now, what, what is that? Is that engineering research? Yes, it is. Okay, what can we do here? Engineering facility... Uh, what does it do, though? It's... Yeah, I don't really want it. Not really interested in space torpedoes. They do all right damage, I guess, but I don't really think I want them. Uh, kinetic battery, again... Not really interested. Don't think I want it. We'll go for space torpedoes since they don't take long, I suppose. Uh, so let's unpause and get everything moving again. I actually think what I'm going to do is get my... I think I'm going to get my second fleet back to Jeff. I'll get my first fleet back to Jeff as well. And then I want to merge all of them, I think. I think that'd be nice to uh, to merge all of my current fleets into one really powerful fleet and then start building a new fleet. I think that could be a cool idea. And I think that might be a good idea because then I end up with... Uh, I end up with one really, really strong fleet and then I get the the joy because it is, it is, it is legitimately fun to build more fleets. I actually do enjoy that. I think it's fun. Uh, so, I mean, this guy's gonna jump to Jeff. There we go. Uh, I want to merge my first and my second plate. Now, what do you have? You have fire rate and hull regeneration. You have evasion. So, I'm actually gonna go and keep fire rate and hull regeneration. Oh, no, I didn't. Uh, well, that's a problem. Uh, I want the fire rate and hull regeneration. Or maybe I don't. Okay. Uh, that's kind of annoying, but apparently I don't get that. There you go. So there's my first fleet. 21.9k. Ridiculous. Ridiculously strong. But I like it. So what we'll do now, I suppose, is go to Spaceport, go to here, and let's say get ourselves a Vader-class ship. Let's get two of them coming up, and we'll start building this new fleet. We have our current first fleet. We're going to have our second fleet. I like this. I do. I'm actually quite pleased with this. I do think we absolutely need to go to here. We need to go to the surface. And uh, we we need some power plants. We do. Let's get a power plant. Uh, these guys might be starving. I don't know. Uh, now, this can actually be upgraded, which is good. So, let's get a planetary administration there. Let's get ourselves another power plant. Uh, so, yes, I want to do that. So, power plant, yes. Uh, I want to do the same thing just here. So, power plant, and yes. Do the same thing just here. So, power plant, and yes. And here as well. We want one of those. Because really, they are the one thing we really, really need. We need power plants because we need to be able to, uh, actually support this army. And uh, monthly upkeep is energy credits. It's not minerals. The minerals are obviously just the building process. So upkeep is the most important thing. So if we can support several fleets of that size, that would be kind of incredible. And I certainly think we're going to need to. We have pushed the Scourge back. It is further away from our borders than it was. 
I think my next goal is absolutely going to be taking these three systems. Uh, I think we, what we might have to do to make that work is possibly give the... What do you call them? The Jesselnox... The... Or the Jesselnox, I don't know. Uh, United Systems, that one. And then I'll take these two. That might have to be a thing to uh, convince them to let it happen. Did they just take another thing? What did they just do? Resource storage full. Oh, it might be that, actually. That alerted me. Okay, sectors missing resources. That's fine. We're fine. Okay, well, ladies and gentlemen, I think I'm going to leave it there for today. Uh, once again, any suggestions, leave them on this video because this is the one video I'll be looking at before I sit down to record another batch of Stellaris to uh, make sure that everything is all good. And uh, yeah, thank you guys for watching. This has been Stellaris. We've been at war, pushing back the Scourge. It's been great. Having a lot of fun with it. I think my goal... I don't know what my goal with this series is going to be. Because I don't necessarily think it's going to be to take over the entire galaxy. Although I feel like at the same time it could be. I just feel like that's going to take a really, 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 really long time. So... We'll see... But I think I might have my goal just be like, take out the Scourge, take out these guys, take out those guys, and just sort of maybe own... I think I think my goal might be to turn against these guys and win. That might be my end goal. But uh, I guess the joy of that is that... Well, the joy of this episode, and this being like my last in the recording session I'm currently in, is that you guys can comment and tell me how stupid that is. So yeah, thank you kind of for watching. This has been Stellaris. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye. Oh, hold on. Whoa, 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 whoa. Whoa, whoa, whoa. What was, something was just under attack. I... I think something might have... I think the Scourge might have come into one of these systems here and just lost. I think we're okay. I think we're fine. Yeah, ladies and gentlemen, that's going to be it. So once again, thank you kind of for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.